you go and now you're right upside it show me well i guess this is why you don't go to the dog park after you're already ready for the day hi friends good afternoon um so today i was supposed to check in at epcot and then we were going to go see the lion king show but animal kingdom closed at seven it's already four o'clock because i spend like my whole entire morning with gracie and taking her to parks and doing things with her because you know i feel like i mean it's just that's my responsibility so instead of that we are at the boardwalk again because last time i feel like i didn't walk around and really enjoy it and then we'll walk over to epcot because it's open till 10 today so maybe i would say tomorrow but tomorrow i'm definitely doing universal so wednesday we can go and see the lion king show and that should be really fun but today on to different things also great news i found my mask i actually washed it and i didn't want to dry it in the dryer so it smells like those little beads it's such a beautiful day outside right now it's like hot because it's like 94 and i'm in, in a spirit jersey which was for a reason but oh my gosh all I smell is the scent boosters. It's magical. It's a little overpowering. I hope that doesn't like make you like go, who knows? If I'm in the middle, oh, okay, I have a beard. <laughs> if I'm in the middle of walking and I just suddenly topple over, you know that the in-wash scent boosters, they're potent. <sighs> Looks like it's another one of those days that are like extremely Quiet. Let's go this way. Muscles and Bustles Health Club. I haven't really seen the new pool slide, but I have a really hard time filming pools because it's so like, eh. You know, we're like so intimate when it comes to the pools. Like we're really like exposing our, you know what I mean? Oh, mi amor. Si we all know un poco loco. Well, the arcade is closed, so we cannot play DDR, which by the way, I am a DDR expert. Well, it used to be. I don't know if I could still do it anymore. That was back in the day. That was like 20 years old. I was obsessed with DDR. So yeah, not very much here is open. I mean, Big Rivers is open, but I think we're gonna take a walk around, like do a little lap, like go to like by the Yacht Club, Beach Club, maybe head into Epcot at that point, and then we'll finish off. Oh wait, I kinda wanna ride the Skyliner. I don't know, I don't know. We never know how it's gonna go. I have had some seriously fun times dancing at the Atlantic Dance Hall. I mean, from times like with like Jake and Carly and just friends, I, I just so much fun. I can't dance and that's why I think I have the most fun. Now jelly rolls on the other hand. I mean, I've had like, I guess fun at jelly rolls, but every time I went, they were always playing the same songs i find it you know and i think i've said this before i just find it really hard to believe that it's not like set like that i don't know i'm still like debating on like if i want to go this way because i know that at nighttime there's like the palm tree pathway which is a blast to walk through it's like a nightclub out in the open so maybe i don't know all right yeah backtrack backtrack i mean things are going according to plan if we're changing the plan already we're gonna go this way do Epcot probably now and then walk the other way around because at that point things will be lit up okay yes heading back heading back this way we are going to do Epcot first walk around there it's so hard because I know once I get to the theme parks I never come back I'm Gatsby <laughs> I am Gatsby. He looked at me. You hear it? And the fireworks are going and you know, he's like. Okay, we're getting closer. I could smell up cop from here. Leave me alone, get it? Like, leave me alone. Okay, it's either Epcot or we take the Skyliner and just travel. And you know what I'm feeling right now? I like the way these buckets look right now. Sorry, Epcot, today is not your day. Wait, should I tap in anyway, just in case I wanna to go to another part of it? Yeah, okay. So, game plan. We go here, we tap in, 
we leave, we go on the Skyliner and we see where the night takes us. Okay, woohoo, we're at Epcot. That was the quickest trip to Epcot on record. Let's go. And this is what we're doing. I almost thought when I went through the gate and scanned that I would be like, oh, I wanna go to Epcot instead. No, we are doing this. We're doing it and we're doing it today. And now the reason I have so many Magic Kingdom videos out is because parking at Magic Kingdom is so hard to just to just run in and tap in and leave. It's really hard. So I kind of like, when I like have like these parks, it's a lot easier for me to park hop, but I usually only get Magic Kingdom. Now I have not fallen in love with these yet. Even though I love Disney transportation, it's still not ready yet for me. I'm sure one day. Ah, we got the Toy Story one. The one right before us is the Haunted Mansion one, but you know what? We can't complain, like we're alive, you know? Here we go. Where's little Rem Rem? Oh we my goodness. goodness. And World Showcase. There's little Rem Rem. He's like my third favorite Disney character. So, oh, why am I talking about all my favorite things today? Anyway, I do love Remy. I think he is so stinking cute. He loves food. He's a rat. He's adorable. He's got little paws, little nose. He's just so cute. So I have actually had to use one of these. I know, so crazy. Like I'm not even making it up. We really legitimately had to use one. Inside is like these like um, ice packets and throw up bags and they have like water in like a packet. It's, you know, all the things you need. They have snacks, Cheez-Its, they've got um, cupcakes, they have Sour Patch Kids, they have jelly beans, they have McDonald's cheeseburgers. It's a really good kit if you ever need it. Right down there to our left is where I got my third, 29th birthday pictures done with Gracie. And we're stopped so you can see it really well. Welcome to Disney's Riviera Resort. I don't know what we're doing here, but I got off anyway. <laughs> oh, look at we're swimming in the fountain. Look at us swimming in the fountain. Well, I'll join you if you don't mind. I'll just take off my shoes and join you. Thank you so much. <laughs> Art. Just beautiful. Well, since they both took up too much room in that fountain, I'm gonna go in this fountain instead. Well, I do find Riviera to be very pretty, I guess. I do not feel Disney coming from it at all. Even the murals on the outside, I just don't feel like really feel Disney to me. I'm also one of the haters of new things. So you know what, you might love this, but me, take me to all-star movies. So yet again, I still have no idea why we're here and why we keep venturing further and further and further into the resort, but it just doesn't stop. I'm still here and I'm inside now. Moana, Viana. I kind of like that name, Vena, Vena. Hola, Rika Rika di Dori. <laughs> or else Spaka internet. And just when you think I would leave because I already said like eight times, I don't know why I'm here. We're gonna get in an elevator and just go to a random floor. Well, if I had no reason to like it, I like it right now. Look at all of these pictures of Walt. Talk about like an idol or a hero. He is 120 million percent mine. Yes. I guess we'll like explore like the grounds and then get back on the elevator, or not elevator, Skyliner and see what else we can find. This is the inside of Primo Piatto. Primo Piatto, see. Si. Primo Piatto, you see. And they have like, you know, like food, like sandwiches. I had a sandwich here once. I didn't love it, but you might love it, you know? I have officially found something that I love about the Riviera Resort. I would give my soul to ride down that slide into the pool. Oh my, and look at the storm clouds. I sat at one of these tables to eat that sandwich, but today we're gonna explore a tiny bit further in. No, we're not. 
not really much down there. Thank you for coming. There is some like kids bop, like Aristocats music playing here. Is this to go down? It's a far jump. Okay. Okay, I did it. I did it again. There's stairs, but I don't know. All right. We're back on track. To what? I don't know. Okay. We are on the Skyliner. We are aboard Mission X. I see Tower of Terror. Uh huh. What's that building right there? If anybody knows what that building is right there, let me know. It's definitely not Space Ranger Lightning McQueen Academy. Well, wait a dang second. Why does it look like Epcot is like a second away? Are we going right back to where we just. What is going on? This is a conspiracy theory. What have I done? You seem to move on easy. Every time I try to fly, I fall without my... Why are we back at Epcot? So, I have just been informed that I got on the wrong side at Riviera. So, I have to get back in this line to get back to Hollywood Studios. Forget about it. We'll drive ourselves. Abort mission. We're not driving. The longer that I sat there and like pretended to be, I was really upset. The line went down. So we can just take the Skyliner. We're still gonna go to Hollywood Studios. We've got this. Okay, so the drama ensues. We are back on the Skyliner and now we are heading back to Hollywood Studios. Would we have been better off just hanging at Magic Kingdom? I mean, I mean Epcot? Yeah, yeah, probably. But a bird pooped on our Skyliner. So we're gonna do something that we have never done here at Hollywood Studios and we're going to do something I'm not gonna say right now. So I heard Fairfax Fair was open today and they had a hot dog salad, which I was super interested in because I would make a salad taste like a hot dog, but it's not open right now. Wow, no wait at all. The music that's playing is the music that used to play at the clubs when I was 23. I swear I really used to be fun. I would like dance around, have fun, you know, enjoy life. We can light it up like it's dynamite. Everybody say yeah. All right, I see the crowd coming out now. That means that we are about to go in any second now. Oh, oh it is time. Oh, oh wow. Volkswagen van or bus, but it was like a beetle. No, um, no, probably wouldn't do it again. So I think now we're going to leave Hollywood Studios because, like, we already just saw Lightning McQueen's Racing Academy, which was like the main reason to be here. The reason everybody comes to Hollywood Studios is for Lightning McQueen's Racing Academy, and I just got to bring it to you guys pretty much live, but like a day later. So now we're gonna go back to our car, which is at the boardwalk. Oh boy, we have to go to the Skyliner, then the Skyliner again, and eventually we're going to be at the car. Okay, so it's been like four years since I've done this, but we are going to walk to Epcot from Hollywood Studios. Send your prayers. It says we're a 30 minute walk from here on the sign right ahead. 30 minute walk from here. Okay, it's been about 85 minutes, we don't have food, we don't have water, we don't have a fence between us and the snakes and the alligators. I know that you guys are worried about me and you do have 911 on speed dial for me and I appreciate that. Type it in now. And magically like that, we are at Disney Springs and we have a secret trick here. I cannot share it too much with you guys because it's so special, but it only works for one of the garages. That's my only hint. 
And here is my last hint of the secret trick. So we came here for Gideon's, but um, there's nothing going on over there but a wait line. So we're gonna try to find something to eat for food wise. Maybe like chicken guy, Gideon's, not Gideon's, oops. Chicken guy or um, Everglades. So we're in line for chicken guy. Um, smells like Brussels sprouts over here, really bad. It smells like horrible. Look. We're getting closer to our chicken. All right, so they don't have ice for the soda, which I mean, I guess like no big deal, but here's the chicken, fries, mac and cheese, ranch, ranch, parmesan. Uh, okay, these are hooked together, so it's like a puzzle. If you guys want to play a puzzle with me or break it, hold on. Oh, yep. It's not greasy, so that's good. Chicken time. Not bad. What I love the most is nothing's greasy. So, it's not like horrible and like overwhelming and like belly achy. I think I felt that way the last time I ate here. But we tried it again. We did. We we gave we gave it a second try. And you know what? Good for us. 